Conventional, organic, local, global. Agriculture is diverse, a variety of people with different farming methods, but all with one goal, to grow healthy, safe, affordable food for families around the world. And there's room at the table for all. We thought this would be a perfect place for us to come and talk about the agriculture we're all part of. Not to say anybody's better or worse, I just want everybody to recognize the value of each other's part of the industry. Farmers and ranchers in Bell County participated in the second annual Mother Earth News Fair in Belton. The event is one of six across the nation, bringing people together not only from the Lone Star State, but as far away as Michigan and Colorado. The event focuses on self-sufficient lifestyles, including organic gardening, renewable energy, natural health, homesteading, and more. A group of consumers, traditional farmers, have been slow to engage. But Bell County farmers want to change that. They use Texas Farm Bureau's mobile learning barn and one farmer's antique corn sheller to get attention and start conversations. Ones they hope build bridges. That's a great attention getter. It brings back a, a lot of memories from, from the, the older generation as well. And it creates a hands-on activity and, and exciting for the kids. And it, it's a great tool for creating discussion. Kids and adults took turns cranking the grinder and shelling corn. It led to discussions about modern agriculture, attendees voicing concerns, and the farmers explaining what they do and why they do it. I said, did you have the choice to choose GMO or non-GMO? And he said, yes. And I said, and you chose GMO? And he said, yes. And I said, why? Because I just understood it to be bad for our bodies, harmful for the soil. And he said because he didn't like seeing starving people and that it cut down on cost, um, cut down on pesticides, and he thought it was good for the environment, good for everybody. Agreeing to disagree. Like Julie, many of the conversations didn't change minds on the spot, but meeting face-to-face -face sparked relationships, ones built on respect, convictions, and understanding. Not seeing each other as enemies, but all striving towards the same goal, a sustainable future for food. It's all about the environment. It's all about Mother Earth and, and trying to save and preserve the environment for ourselves and for future generations. I don't want to see anybody go hungry in the world. People are passionate about what they eat, and they should be. Very little is more important than what we put into our bodies, whether it's organic or conventional, GMO or non. American families can be confident the food they eat is just as safe and just as healthy, no matter how it's grown. For TFB News, Ed Wolf, Belton.